Welcome to another video in the LaTeX Tutorials, a comprehensive series. Now let's say I insert another figure and I will just copy this. See, and I will paste it here. This is centering include Ropix. The scale is one right, but now this time I will insert this GTR figure and this is gtr and i will write its caption is general theory of relativity and i give it a label is the same gtr and i now build this document and you see that figure 1.2 because it now understand it's the second figure and it is general theory of relativity general theory of relativity so if I look at this figure I just minimize a little bit it is cutting here so it means this scale is not good so I will reduce the scale let's say I almost half of the image is cut so I reduce it to 0.5 and now let's see now all the images coming in here we can even reduce this thing to 0.45 in order to look at the center yes and this is figure 1.2 general theory of relativity now if for example we move this figure to another chapter and then slash chapter and let's say this chapter is literature review and now you will see that this will change chapter 1 this is figure this is chapter 2 and this is his figure and it is 2.1 so it will automatically do the numbering with the leveling command similarly the same thing can be changed here that if for example I just comment the chapter now it will be automatically over there that this is 1.2 and let's say I have written here let's say I have written here this is the GTR image is shown in figure slash reference and I give this GTR and I build this and you can see here this document is a tutorial on how to insert figure this this was shown in this and this is gtr images shown in figure this so if i press double slash here means the enter here or better to do that enter at this point then you will see that this is the gtr image is shown in figure this so figure numbering 1.1 and 1.2 now for example i activate this chapter which is literature review now you run this and you see that chapter 2 and it has been moved this is the gtr image is shown in figure 2.1 so it has designated another you can say numbering here and it is 2.1 so we don't need to worry about the numbering of the figures LaTeX will do it automatically and now for example after the begin document we write list of figures so list of figures is here and then the introduction and I just build this document you see it has generated a page list of figures 
and this is my first figure and this is on page this and this is the second one it is on page this and then the chapters and all this so this is a very easy way to insert figures in LaTeX now let's go through this one here the book will explain you many parameters like begin figure and end figure and here we are having some options in the square brackets we call these the position specifies for the figure in the document for example in front of the begin figure here if we write in square brackets h it means the figure to be placed here if we write t it should be on the top of the page and b for the bottom and p for a separate page an exclamation mark is this which will force LaTeX to place it at the specified location sometime we want it to be at the top of the page but LaTeX will be giving it another location even writing t will not do the job because LaTeX decide few things by itself but if you do the exclamation mark in front of it like in front of t or b then it will be at that place which is due to the size and image more than the available space it is way. if no placement in the form of this so LaTeX will decide wherever it will see that thing suitable okay if multiple placements are specified like BT it is the flexibility given to LaTeX to place the figure either at bottom or at the top so let's say practice this thing a little bit our figure is here so it is not a very big figure it can be over here so let's try to do this thing at that point and these are the brackets and I just say H and you see that it has moved the figure over here because I have written this thing at the location means I specify the location let's say we write at the top now we know that this is a chapter and above the chapter it cannot place this figure so definitely it will be moved to the next page top let's build this and here we see that it has been placed over here now after this we write some text then automatically this thing will be going to the top C and let's say after this I just write this text and you can see the text is coming in here and the figure is yet here but if the text will become more than this and it comes to the page 2 then this will automatically be at the top of the page similarly we can practice with the other things normally in a book it is very uh, easy to leave this thing without any option and let the LaTeX decide its suitable position okay here is explaining what is center and include graphics and all this and here with this figure and this was a brief tutorial or a brief chapter regarding inserting the figures so hopefully in the next video we will start with chapter 6 which is really very important from the point of view of mathematics and equations thank you for watching this video and stay tuned for the next video